hello YouTube in this video I'm gonna show you how to install an unofficial Android 4.4.4 build for, on your Samsung Galaxy S3 it is touched is used 4.4.4 okay actually this is uh, the ROM is called back to note okay and actually this is a ported ROM it is ported from Korean version of Galaxy S3 LTE, the Exynos Galaxy S3 LTE, okay. And this Arthur Arthur 97 XDA developer ported those from that ROM to our Galaxy S3 IN9300. So we we'll look for the download link here. Is the download link? Go and download from that link. As you can see, I already downloaded it. So I'm copying this file to my Galaxy S3. Okay. Okay, I connected my Galaxy S3 as you can see here. I'm copying this one and go there in ROMs folder and pasting it. Here you can see I copied that downloaded ROM file to my phone's SD card. So next I am going to restart my phone into custom recovery mode. I am using a TWRP custom recovery. If you didn't install TWRP custom recovery, you can find a link in the video description. It will show you how to install TWRP. So get enter into TWRP, you have to press volume up, home button and power button at the same time. Press and hold until this logo comes when, when it logo comes we will just release all those buttons then the phone will load to TWRP recovery so first you go and back up do an android backup from here in case if anything goes wrong and then wipe just wipe swipe this one to wipe data cache and Dalby cache actually to do factory reset ok it's done so go back then install then search for the downloaded ROM file is here the ROM file ok here is the back to note so I am selecting it and swipe to install so it started installing now it will take some time please be patient you can see it's loading here Okay, here you can see the installation is successful. So now reboot the phone. I'm going to if you need super SU, I mean if you need the rooted ROM, you can simply do this. I'll go with the rooted ROM. So it started showing boot animation. Remember that the first boot will take some time because it has to build that Dalby cache. Okay, just finalize the installation with these eight settings. I'll choose the language English. Can do the Wi-Fi settings here. I'll do it later. Just agree and. Uh, Gmail account and then give your name Samsung account setting you can select which you need okay device name that's it Okay, so now you will be running on the latest unofficial 4.4.4 ROM. You can see the settings about device. Here you can see 4.4.4. 
Kit Kat. Okay. Uh, you can see the below description for a quick review or full review of this ROM. So please have take have a look at. Okay, that's it. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more.